Hey everybody, how's it going? We're back. Uh, this time we're talking about uh, another Netflix film, Bright. Starring Will Smith and uh, that other guy. Joel Edgerton. Yeah. I, uh, I'm going to let you talk first. Because cause I have a lot of horrible things to say. <laughs> Spoilers! It is a film that's supposed to be a mashup between like a fantasy and a cop drama. So when you watch it, you get a lot of cop. But like a lot of cop. You have to wade through the F-bombs. Kind so of. many F-bombs. First 15 minutes, everybody's saying, just F-bombs, mother F's and these F's and F, 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 F. It's just lazy writing. Nobody talks like that. Yes, people swear. People swear all the time. But people don't swear every third word. It's just lazy writing. It was lazy, lazy writing. And I'm disappointed in Will Smith. He's better than that. Okay, and moving on. If you're going to do a fantasy element, then please don't swat the fairy in the first three seconds, you know? Like, really? What the hell are you swatting the fairy for, poor thing? And I mean, they, they treated the orcs badly, and it, I felt, personally, that it missed everything that makes fantasy, fantasy and fun. To be perfectly honest, I didn't even finish the film. David Ayer is not my favorite director, first of all. Let's just get that out there. His track record is abysmal. He's had two films that have scored above 50% on Rotten Tomatoes, IMDb, and Metacritic. His average score is somewhere in the low 20s. Suicide Squad. Suicide Squad. I mean, what? You don't... Yeah. I think this could have been done differently. I think it could have been written differently. I was so looking forward to the idea of, like Yoli says, but having this mashup between a fantasy world and a cop drama, and, and it just sounded like such a great idea. And the trailer was great. The, mm. the trailers lie. Trailers always lie. And it's also quite sad because Max Landis wrote it, and he's the guy who did Dirk, Dirk Gently's Holistic Detective Agency, which I loved. The TV series. Yeah. Yeah, that was, the first season it was, was fantastic. It was brilliant. I watched both seasons. They were great. Cool. They were really thumbs up from me, but um, I really didn't enjoy Bright. I think he just totally missed all the fun stuff that makes fantasy so awesome and that makes the fans go, yes! They just The magic was a bit scary and sort of loose, and the whole world felt very fake. It felt very much like somebody had sort of gone, and stuck like all the people in different areas and gone, okay, so that's how we're going to portray them. They hadn't given them any depth. There was no character to any of the people. In fact, the only person I, I managed to identify with in the film was Joel Edgerton's character, the rookie orc cop. He was like the only one. It didn't fly in this house anyway. I don't know, maybe you guys want to give it a, a look and, you know, tell us what you think. Yeah, no, hey, don't, don't take our word for it. <laughs> We're just voicing an opinion. If you agree with us, or don't agree with us, hey, hit the comments below, let us know. Yeah. Um, we're always open to other people's opinions, mostly. Just don't disagree with me. He, he's not, but I don't mind. You guys can voice your opinions as much as you like. It's About great. her viewpoint, not mine. I'm always right. Mm-hmm. Yes, like. I think we're done slamming Bright. You uh, slammed it. I slammed it. I really didn't like this I story. thought I was quite constructive. I, well, you know, you're a nicer person than I am. <laughs> um, thanks so much for watching, everybody. We'll be back again with some new stuff, some more movies we've seen. We're looking at Games Night, which looks like could be a kind of fun movie. Jason Bateman. Um, oh, that looks like it's going to be crazy. Um, yeah, so we'll <laughs> let you know what we cool. thought of that. And uh, yeah, check back here. Anything you'd like us to look at, we are open to old movies, new movies, new releases, Whatever. old releases. Give us some ideas, man. Hit the comments below and uh, we'll see you again real soon. <laughs>